it's been a long time dream, you know, to fly in this area. So many high peaks, like alone in the middle of jungle, you know, it's, uh, it's very different. The location is just incredible, it's completely magical, you know, it's a very, it's very special place. It's a, it's a place like there is a, no other in the, in the world, so it's, it's, we, are, we are very lucky to be able to come and fly here. So we're here in China for 16 days at this amazing location to shoot Jetman. They're going to be doing stunts all around the mountain and the reason we need so much time is we're here in a microclimate so we're battling against the weather every day and some days we get no chance to shoot, some days we get a, a very small window and so I'm optimistic that uh, over the, the next 16 days that we're going to get some great stuff. I think this was a dream for the pilots uh, for a long time to come to China. I mean, this place has so much history in their initial sport wingsuit flying and it never gets more epic than this. Our camera crew has arrived and uh, everybody else has arrived. Gary and I have been scouting for the last four days and we are showing all of the camera crew their locations. What's going to be amazing here yeah. is if you're tracking with him across the rocks. That's yeah, going to look yeah, sure. really yeah. fast, right? Now he is feeling pretty close. Yep, yeah. yep, yep. No, I like that frame. We're, I'd say 90% there. We've gone through all our scouts, which is pretty awesome. Uh, the only thing left now, we're going to scout with Vince and Fred just to make sure all the jumps and all the positions that we decided are pretty much lock solid. It's not something that we're going to do many times. So we are going to do it two times, so then we all get the shot. For sure, we feel good about it. It's great for my, uh, for my hips. <laughs> We always do a ground recce and then we'll do the same in the helicopter and we'll fly the routes and the lines. Just like any formation team, you need to plan on the ground first and then we run up uh, the helicopter and fly those lines above the mountain. We have two choppers in total, one's uh, for the jetman and one's the filming chopper. It took like nine hours to ferry the second chopper to the location for the project. It's a safe arrive, so everyone is so happy about this. But uh, uh, although a little bit raining, but you know, it's warm in our heart. The main issue we've got at the moment is uh, the language barrier um, with the pilots, but uh, it's something that we'll, we'll get over. Uh, the pilots we have are very intuitive and we've brought our, our own pilot to also help train them that's uh, got many years of experience with Jetman. So I flew with the two pilots. Uh, all dropping pilot now is 100% uh, ready to go. Uh, his flight is soft. He understood the mission. So we did all the scenario like we had the Jetman on board. After the jump, we climb. To we climb 6,000 6, in the left hand side of the of oh, the oh. cave. So if you tell us emergency, emergency on your side, pop us. We drop the wing. We come back inside the helicopter and then we follow your instruction. As you can imagine, it's. Uh, until the first flight's out of the way, the, uh, the uncertainty of what we're uh, getting ourselves into is still there. So tensions are high, but um, I, I've got utmost faith in the boys that uh, they're gonna get up there and they're gonna enjoy themselves and then we're gonna be good. So the boys have seen the mountain. They're feeling really good about it. Uh, we're getting ready to head up on our first flight and start making the magic. I mean, at the end of the day, the weather much better in the afternoons. Yes. Just ATC as usual, uh, being this close to the airport is, is an issue, but we'll work around it and they'll work around us. This is going to be our biggest thing yeah. on, on any of our flight paths. We'll always talk it through, we'll always know where Jetman's supposed to be, where the helicopter's supposed to be. My part, uh, the flight went uh, good. I was following Fred, but I had some problem with uh, interference on the on my radio. 
that we are trying to figure out if it's coming from our display that we have that gives our speed and everything, or if it's coming from the new camera that we put. Let's hope that tomorrow we have less cloud a bit earlier and that we can enjoy the whole day. Fog is probably our worst problem. Um, visibility, obviously. Uh, the guys need to see the ground, uh, both the helicopter pilots and Jetman. Uh, it's just, yeah, this is the worst we could have it. We just hope that the, the bad weather goes away as soon as possible and then we can uh, finish the, the flights that we are planned and then finish this, uh, this shooting with, uh, with beautiful images. The first time when they talked to me about you will be the first Emirati Jetman, I couldn't believe that man. Why are they choosing Ahmed al Shahi for this project? Then when I do my first interview in the Jetman office, I said, it's the, the dream is coming here. And I need to focus about this point. I hope I can be the first Jetman Emirati. And I'm really excited to see my mentors that are flying here in this place in China. And I'm excited to fly with them in the future. So weather has been a factor over the last several days. We haven't been able to fly very much, uh, but today is pretty stunning. Today is our gate day, and uh, nerves are high right now. Uh, everybody's gearing up, getting ready to go up, and uh, yeah, it's uh, it's go time. It's uh, this is by far the hardest flight that we have uh, have uh, ever done, and uh, friend Vince are extremely focused. They're feeling good. They're prepped. Uh, everybody is in position on the camera team. So we'll be 1300 and then going through middle of the hole. We start to go that way and they catch us. Mm. Oh, yeah. And then they come and land. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be a great flight. This is our last chance to, uh, to nail the, the flight through the gate. Waiting for that god ray to poke through. I don't see it yet. amazing experience you know coming from behind and like you see the hole and then like going through at that speed you know following my friend it was uh, I was uh, emotional it was very intense you know to to fly in there and uh, yeah like Vince was saying it was just a, a huge achievement that uh, we've been able to do thanks to to the whole team here so it's a uh, it's a real big teamwork so today's our last day we're at the Hero Temple, shooting a Tai Chi scene. Uh, the guys are pretty into it, learning something new. Beautiful place, as you can see, amazing surroundings. A lot of cultural history here. We got to hang out with some actual Tai Chi masters. Uh, we had an actual monk come and, and ring the, the big bell for us. So, a really good experience for everybody. We're happy to be wrapping up today. And yeah, looking forward to getting to the edit. For so sure. much happened in the last yeah. 15 days man. and uh, mind blowing to to be able to fly in this uh, in this beautiful place i mean it's just like every flight was was amazing imagine we did 13 flight and about like 8 minutes flight every time you know so it's like we spent already like uh, more than an hour up there you know flying so it's uh, it's the amount of footage that we have in our head uh, is, uh, it's uh, <laughs> it's a lot man